Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. This is Moe Garcia and I have here a new Bible review for you. This is the ESV Premium Finline Bible in black goatskin in the English Standard Version that uh, our friends in uh, Crossway uh, very, very graciously have sent to me for an honest uh, review. And uh, here's the, the box, it came in, very nice box. As you can see, it comes with uh, their pledge. This is a lifetime guarantee, basically. And um, it says here that because of its quality materials and expert craftsmanship, this ESV Bible is guaranteed to last for as long as uh, you use it. If you should experience any defect in its printing or failure in its binding during normal use, we will replace it with a Bible of equal or greater value. So that is assurance right there. And uh, let's take a look at this uh, uh, lovely Bible. As you can see, it has a lovely grain on the cover. This is goat skin cover. And uh, I am impressed with this uh, goat skin. I really like it. This is not stamped, this is natural goat. And uh, on the spine, we're gonna see that they have one, two, three, and four raised hubs. Uh, very sharp. I really like that. Look at this. Very well defined. And we got Holy Bible, ESV logo, English Standard Version, and Crossways. Uh, typical logo that they have on the bottom of the spine very nice indeed it comes with perimeter stitching all around so you can see and it has a calfskin liner right here uh, very soft and you can see but it, it feels sturdy it doesn't feel uh, too floppy but it is thin it's not a very thick cut of uh, of leather and uh, it does come with this gold gilt line around the perimeter as well it is leather lined which means that part of the cover goes into the text block so this is not going to break after many years of usage that happens normally with uh, paper bags and uh, uh, paste downs and here indeed we have that this is goat skin leather right there stamped it comes with uh, two ribbon markers so I can show you there there you go they're black so you can see and the dimensions of this Bible are as follows this is a nine and three quarters of an inch tall and we got here six and a half and measuring the spine we're gonna see that this is around uh, one inch and a quarter so we got this vinyl uh, and sheets in black some uh, Glossy cardstock paper on front. Our presentation page. Presentation page right here. The Holy Bible. This is the first page in uh, thin paper. Another one right here. And then this one is going to tell us that indeed this is the ESV text edition 2016, which is the latest uh, that they put out. It's printed in China and this was printed in uh, 2019. Here we have the table of contents. Uh, the books of the Bible in alphabetical order. We go here the preface. The Old Testament. And we start here with Genesis. As you can see, there is a big, nice inner margin so that the text doesn't run into the into the gutter. Now this is a paragraph style, double column text with all the translator notes right here on the bottom. 
it doesn't have references it's just plain text now this is a very readable text I think I could call this a nine point font and it is a, a nice paper there is no much ghosting going uh, there is no much ghosting happening in this Bible I don't see a lot of it um, but this Bible is not line matched which means that the lines on one side of the page will not match the lines on the other side so if that's a problem for you this Bible is not for you even though because of the quality of this paper I do not see any distractions uh, due to the lack of line matching let's go for example to a book such as here we go uh, Job where there's a lot of uh, basically blank space and I don't see a lot of uh, distraction from the back side I don't see very portable very lightweight readable probably my camera is gonna pick up more ghosting that I actually see with my naked eye right here and uh, yeah this is not heavy at all this is a very portable Bible that I would bring anywhere with me and extremely flexible check that out I like this ghost skin feels uh, durable it doesn't feel like it's gonna scratch easily and this Bible also comes with gold on the page edges and red under, underneath what we call art guild you can see that the gold there and then when you open it up you will get this light red I think it's classy and it frames also the page to help you also focus on the text right here in the middle so I like that it is a black letter edition for those who don't like the red letter well this is black letter uh, here's an example in Matthew 25 for example here there's no words of Jesus in red they're all black as the rest of the Bible which again I think is great if you're gonna be highlighting or uh, writing small uh, references or notes on the margins you can because these margins are actually quite generous for a thin line Bible I'm very I'm very impressed with this amount of margin definitely it doesn't run into the gutter It's gonna help you read this very very well I'm happy with this and if we go on to the back this Bible even includes a concordance check this out the ESV concordance uh, it says in the ESV premium Finline Bible contains more than 2,400 word entries and nearly 10,000 scripture references each word entry is followed by a selected list of brief phrases showing the contexts in which each entry occurs so there have there you have a very good concordance in three column and even though it's a small font I can read this very well my eyesight is not the best but I can read this no problem whatsoever check that out okay so we're gonna go to the very end of this Bible and we're gonna find that we have one blank page in Bible paper and then we have here some of the crossways maps typical maps in thicker cardstock with a glossy finish same as that you will find in, in uh, magazines it comes with this excellent I believe this is one of the best maps uh, of Jerusalem in the times of Jesus I really like this one every time I see it I, I, I smile because it's one of my favorite maps and uh, that's that couple of pages cardstock 
and our cover again. So that's my review for today. I really recommend the, this Bible. I will put a link in the description box in case you would like to purchase it. And, uh, and give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. That will help me a lot. Thanks very much. And I'll see you then in another Bible review or rebind. Until then, Shalom.